Steelers coming up on EA Sports as we get ready for today's Week 4 matchup. We're getting set for kickoff. Any last thoughts here about these two teams, both coming off the of losses last week? Uh, I think what they did, they learned a lot off their losses last week, not to make those mistakes again. They're very determined. And when you have two determined teams to lose two in a row in the NFL, boy, that's hard to overcome. So it's going to be a hard-hitting game. First down, offense ready for the snap. An extra tight end on the field for this one. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. And a gain of four. Now we'll get a look at the Jets' offense. They will be expecting far greater efficiency today. A week ago, they turned it over on three occasions. The Jets will go with the pistol on this play. The Jets will take the snap from the 25. And this will end up as a two-yard loss. Now a look at the Steelers' defense. They know they need to force turnovers today. Coming off a game in which they had no takeaways. On this passing down, the defense comes out in the nickel. There's some shifting around in the backfield. The Jets take it from the 23. Almost intercepted. Every quarterback in the NFL is going to have one or two passes a game that can be picked off. Most of the time they're dropped, and this time that was a bad drop by the defense. This punt will be returned. Shrugs off the first hit. First down coming up. Nickel formation for the defense here. Bell's handed the football. Tackle down at the 46-yard line. Always a chess match early in the game to see what your opponent is going to do. Good run that time by the offense. They pick up good yards. Maybe the defense will have to start crowding the line of scrimmage more. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Bryant's in the slot. Bell's going to take the handoff now. Gets about nine on the play. That's a nice, powerful statement as they establish the run at the beginning of this game. Yeah, Jim, I, you're, you're right. I'm going to give the offense a little credit here, but, you know, somewhere, I don't know, maybe the defense going to have to put some weights in their pockets. you got to hang in there and make the tackle. Second down after going to the ground game, the first play. Ben Roethlisberger takes a look down from under center. And they bring it down at the 36-yard line. Here's a look at the Steelers' offense. They will be expecting far greater efficiency today. A week ago, they turned it over on three occasions. Freeman still has the football on the sneak. Freeman's got all the angles when it comes to the quarterback sneak. It's a quick snap. Then he finds the running lane, gets down, and picks up the first down yardage. First down here after the run. Nickel formation here for the defense. Throws to the right. Roethlisberger sends it to Brown. Brown's met at the 16. Roethlisberger's job is to sell that play fake. And boy, did he do it that time. It fooled the defense, and they get the completion. First down here after the completion. Split backfield here. Set up screen. Has his target. The Steelers offensive coordinator does a good job that time calling the pass. Down here in the red zone. Caught the defense off guard. They got the completion for a good game. Second down here. 
Wide receivers are bunched up. Touchdown, Pittsburgh Steelers. Well, when you get close to the goal line, you always have to look out for the tight end because any time there's a, just a little bit of deception, that deception is enough for the tight end to get that area where he can get open. That time he does it, touchdown. The Steelers getting set now for the point after. And the extra point is good. The Jets are ready to return the kick. And they stop him from running it out to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Pryor's going to be in the pistol here. They'll run it here. Going to lose yards here. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. The Jets have to be hoping this doesn't turn out like last week's game. Tough luck losers a week ago and trailing in another tight one right now, Phil. We're going to find out if they learned anything from last week's tight loss. And Jim, when you get in situations like this, it's about making that one play that gives your team a good chance to win. Third down. Chris Johnson lined up in the backfield. Flyers going to take the snap from the shotgun. Looking to go deep. And they can't connect. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long, they can do just about anything, and it's going to work. And they stop the offense that time. Quigley will be called on now to punt the football. He wants to return this one. That'll stop the play right there. First down here. Gets the handle here. Right side. Fights off the hit. Picks up eight here. Nothing like a good trap play. When you play defensive linemen who like to get up the field a little too quick, let them get up the field, have a pulling guard, knock them out, and then run in there behind them to get those yards. He is tackled down at the 38-yard line. Bell is able to show everybody why he should get the football more. Good job that time finding his way and picking up a first down. Offense lines up here. First down and 10. Will go ground. And they are in on Bell. Steelers offensive line will be whooping it up tomorrow when they watch this play in the field room. What a good job by them. Excellent planning and awesome execution. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Brown's lined up now as a slot receiver. They're setting up screen. Nothing there as this goes for a loss of two. It's been all about the defenses today as we welcome you back to the action. Pass. Complete, but did not get them the first, so it's second down now. The defense comes out in the nickel. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. You talk about controlling the flow of the game. Another first down, and the drive keeps on going. Yeah, why not? The defense, they're just sitting over there. They're taking the hits and not even fighting back. It's a terrible job by the defense. 
First and ten. Bell's got it on the handoff. The Steelers get a first down. Good job by the offense getting the first down in the red zone. Now it becomes tricky. Can you deceive the defense where you get a chance to get a score? Play number six coming up on this drive. First and goal from the two. And that pass is going out of bounds. Incomplete. Number seven. And here we have second down. The Jets defense now is going to go nickel. And he's in. Never be satisfied in the NFL. Players are just too good. So when you get a chance to score, even though you're leading, take advantage of it. Awesome job by the coordinator on those play calls. The Jets are ready to return the kick. He'll take it from the one. They face first down. Friars got two tight ends on the field for this snap. They'll mark him at the 46. Myers lined up two tight end set. Second down and two. Set up screen to Johnson. Nothing there on the screen. Pass falls incomplete. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. Offense lines up here. Chris Johnson takes the handoff. And he's going to be tackled. And that's going to bring us to fourth down. Johnson's looking for a place to run the football that time. To pick up the third down and short. But nowhere to go. Offensive line gets dominated. Now it's fourth down. They are close enough to a first to go for it here on fourth down. The jumbo set on the field. Friars going to keep it on the sneak. Tackle down right around the 48. The sneak picks up the first down, and I know from your career, that's something you took a lot of pride in. Okay, I was a great quarterback sneaker. You know, I couldn't run for five, but I could sneak for a couple inches. And, you know, Dan Reeves taught me that. Read the defense, know where to go. I did learn that, and it did work out very well for me my last year in the league. Split backfield here. First down at the 48. They're going to get him here for a sack. I don't know if they were confused or not, but the left side of the offensive line that time, they were not aggressive. They got pushed back, and they give up a sack of the quarterback. The defense got to the quarterback, and the offense is backed up here on second down. Pryor comes out in the pistol. Tight ends in motion here. And the give now to Chris Johnson. Nice piece of running. Johnson's tackled down. Always good to have these types of runs. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Johnson is in the backfield. The Jets have it at the 44. He's scrambling down. Room to work. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. Jim, when you get in these situations, there's not much you can do. Third long, not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations.
the Steelers come out for the next possession. Now first and ten. They run the counter play. Searching for space to the right. Picks up maybe three. This is one good tackling defense. They stay in good position at all times. And we saw it that time when they stopped the play for a short game. It's now second down and seven after the three-yard rush. Offense lines up here. Roethlisberger from the gun. Sticks to his hands. And he's on the sidelines out of bounds. Well, on second down that time, nice decision by the quarterback. Now they got it to third short. The defense, it all goes against them, of course. Now they don't know whether it's going to be a run or a pass. They come to the line on third down. They did an excellent job of executing in these spots last week. Now looking at third down. They load it up now. Bring out the jumbo formation. And an incomplete pass that time as he threw it short. On third downs, the defense knows in most situations it's going to be a pass. And let's give some credit to the defensive front. They pressure the QB and they force the incompletion. the stop they come to the line and it's first down prior set in the pistol screen reaches out and grabs it Brought down after a gain of six. The pass play was good for five. Second and five coming up. Wasting little time. And looking underneath, this will go incomplete. Let's see what they do on this third down situation. The Jets come out in the pistol. And it's going to be dropped with a sack, and they're going to be punting after a short series. Well, the defense has got to be excited. Anytime on third down they make the play, uh, they get pretty fired up. But when you sack a quarterback on third down, that is one happy and emotional defense right now. Quigley will be called on now to punt the football. Gets away. This is a big time return. What a good job by the punt returner that time. He caught it. Didn't panic. He waited. He saw the blocking in front of him. Made some good decisions and a good punt return. First down on the way. Ben Roethlisberger takes a look down from under center. He has the grab. Still on his feet. The tackle is made at the 40-yard line. So they complete one, and still it's second down. Browns, a receiver in the slot. Bell's taking the handoff. And that's a gain of nine. Bell is a very smart runner. He knows situations in the game. He saw the first down yard markers, and what does he do? He gets past them and picks up the first down. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Offense lines up here. They run the counter play. Breaks the tackle. He's tackled right at the 31. After being stuffed at the line of scrimmage, it's now second down and 10. They're going to the hurry up offense and they're back to the line quickly. Throws the pass. 
almost made the catch, but the collision jarred it loose. Good anticipation that time by the defender. He gets to the receiver just as the football is arriving, and he makes a beautiful hit to knock the football loose. This is third down. Offense lines up here. Got the completion. And he's brought to the ground. The Steelers use another timeout here, and they have one left. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Roethlisberger's setting up now in the pistol. Looking to the right side and throwing. Makes the catch. Touchdown. Well, you got a lead. Now you're able to go out there and drive down the field and score a touchdown. This changes how the other team is going to manage the game from here on out. The point after try is in the books. Steelers setting up here for the kickoff. He'll have a chance to take off. And the tackle's made right around the 26-yard line. First down here. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Johnson's going to secure the handoff. And picks up seven. The Jets call a timeout and are left now with only one. Second down. Ohio! Ohio! Ready for intermission. First, one more play. Heaving it down the field. And it's incomplete. So that's going to do it for the first half. Steelers are up here in this one. We'll be back with our halftime report after the break. Okay, Larry, looking sharp back in that studio. Thank you for that. And now we're ready to get the third quarter underway as these teams take the field. Able to move past the 20 and brought down at the 23. The Steelers are set for their next possession. The Steelers take it from the 23. Trying the right side. Breaks the tackle. They'll mark him at the 34. Good job by the offense here with a good lead in the second half. Picking up that first down. And that's what you want to do. Take your time. Look at the play clock. Take it down as low as you can. And keep picking up those first downs. Offense lines up here. The Steelers have it at the 34. And the tackle is made at the 41. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. Second down coming up. Ben Roethlisberger takes a look down from under center. Bell's handed the football. And at the 49, he'll be brought down. Bell's a great buddy back to have on your football team, isn't he? He goes up in there and gets the first down. Now your offense has three more chances. First down here after the run. Offense lines up here. Staying on the ground. They are in on Bell. Anytime you picked up a couple first downs, here's what happens. The defense starts to doubt what they're doing, but maybe more importantly, it gets those big boys over there tired. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Offense lines up here. It's the old counter play. Takes it out right. The tackle is made. Good job of the defensive line standing in there and fighting, and they hold the running back to a short game. Second down here after that run play. Offense lines up here. Setting up screen. Catch made. That's a gain of six. 
Good job by the play caller that time. Calling for the short pass, even though it comes up short of the first down, it opens up many things that you can do on third. You can run a reverse, draw plays, screen plays, or if you want, you can still throw it down the field. Brings it into his body. A foot race to the end zone. Taking it all the way home for the touchdown. Even on short passes, accuracy is a big, big deal. When you put it on them, right in stride, look what happens. They catch it in stride. They don't slow down, of course, and good things happen. Nice touchdown run. They'll take it at the 20. It's first down as they head to the line. Set up screen. Tackle just three yards short of the first. That was a nice reception, but not enough for the first down. Second down coming up. No time to huddle now. We'll run it. Here's the handoff. Shakes off the hit. Nice piece of running by Chris Johnson. All you can do is your job. And that was a good job by the offense. Picking up the first down. You're down big in the second half. Hey, don't worry about the score right now. Just find ways to execute plays and get that a takeaway. He stacked up at that point. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fools, being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. First down, go, go, offense go, go. readying for the snap. Offense lines up here. Bell's going to take the handoff now. Breaks out of that one. being stuffed at the line of scrimmage it's now second down and ten takes it on the counter Bowman's the one who made the big stop the Steelers offensive coordinator he has Number to be 13. frustrated by that play I think he calls the right play but what happens the run loses yards that's just a bad job at the offensive line third down now Bells lined up in a single back formation. Two, 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 two. The Steelers will use a timeout here early in the second half. Third down on the way. Offense lines up here. The wide receiver shifting around in motion. He'll throw it over the middle. Incomplete as he was looking short. Defensive coordinators love this situation, don't they? Third and long. They can do just about anything, and it's going to work. And they stop the offense that time. The Jets ready to take over the football. Johnson's lined up as the single back. He takes it on the counter. He's going to be tackled right around the 46-yard line. They went with the ground game on first down, bringing up second. They're going to the hurry. Back to the line now. Here's the hand. The ball's loose. Oh, they cough up the football, and the defense takes possession. Well, that's what you call a takeaway. That time, the defense just hit the ball carrier so hard that he had to give the football up, and they lose it. First down coming up. Ben Roethlisberger takes a look down from under center. He's looking to the right here on this throw. That brings the play to an end. Tick, 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 tick. That's what we're trying to do. Make that clock keep running down. You got the offense out there. You got a big lead in the second half. Every first down you get shortens that football game. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Split backfield here. Can't find speed. 
space, and this will be a loss of one on the play. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. After being stuffed at the line of scrimmage, it's now second down and ten. Split backfield here. Roethlisberger's back in shotgun formation. Finds his mark. He's tackled at the 28. Well, it's a nice throw and catch by the quarterback and receiver. Puts him in good position where they have a chance to pick up this third down. It's third down coming up. Bell takes his spot in the backfield. Roethlisberger takes the snap from the gun. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. Nice job that time by the defense, knowing the situation. Go ahead and let the quarterback complete the pass. Just make sure you come up and make the tackle before the first down. Good job. Fourth down coming up. This will be a field goal attempt from 45 yards out. Good. Well, the defense is going to be excited. They come out there. The offense has great field position, but they stop them. But they give up three points, but still a victory for the defense. He'll take it from the one. And the tackle's made right around the 26-yard line. The Jets offense now coming out. The Jets at the line of scrimmage. Split backfield. First down at the 26. And he's thrown to the ground. Well, the right side, Jim. The right tackle and the right guard. They look confused. They don't know what to do. So they just get run over. And the quarterback falls down. It's now second down. He's setting up here. He's here been go. sacked four here times go. already. What a beating it has been for the quarterback. And he's sacked again. Good job with the safety getting that sack. I'll, I'll say this. He can tackle. He can cover. And he's shown us he can blitz two and get to the quarterback. On the way, third down. The defense comes out of the dime. ball but they can't connect Jim when you get in these situations there's not much you can do third long not easy to pick up first downs in these type of situations wants to give it a go here Come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Miller's playing out of position in the backfield here. For about four. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. That second down coming up. Defense comes out in a 4-6 formation. Catch made. He's brought to a halt. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. It'll be third down. For this play, they'll go with two tight ends. Play clock's running down. Bell's got it on the handle. Tackle's made, and the first down is picked up. 
Bell is able to show everybody why he should get the football more. Good job that time finding his way and picking up a first down. Defense filling up the box here with a 4-6 formation. First down at the 43. Miller's taking the handoff. And they bring it down at the 38-yard line. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. This will be second down. Ben Roethlisberger takes a look down from under center. Bell's going to secure the handoff. He'll be taken down about three yards short of the first. Got to give a lot of credit to the defense. They were all over the run that time, and they only give up a short game. Two and a half minutes to go, fourth quarter, and it's third down. Big set here for the defense, lining up in the 4-6. And now we reach the two-minute warning. Third down. The Steelers are going to call a timeout. Want to talk about this third down. After that last carry, it's third and three. Defense with plenty of bodies in the box here on this play. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. And this fires the football team up. The defense, third and short. They stop the run, keeps the offense short of the first down, and look at the excitement on the defensive side. No good. An empty trip for the offense. Oh, and that football went up. It looked like it was going to be good, but he just, just misses it. The Jets getting set now for their next Ohio, series. Ohio. Priors lining up in the pistol. First down at the 42. The give running to the left side. Picks up about five. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this, over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. Pryor's going to be in the pistol here. Second down, four to go. Chris Johnson takes the handoff, and he's tackled down after picking up the first. Well, you're really in a tough spot, but that is a good job picking up the first down. You're down big in the second half. All you can do, just keep picking up those first downs. You hope it leads you to a score, and then you play the game from there. Pryor comes out in the pistol. First down at the 47. Airing it out. And it's incomplete. Oh, they went for the big play that time, but just couldn't connect. I love it. I love it when offenses and quarterbacks throw the football down the field. Big plays went in the NFL. I'm, you know, Jim, I got to be honest. I'm sick of seeing all this dinking and dunking. Let's look for some big plays and chuck it down there. Well, that'll make you feel a little better. Finally getting a first down. You're down big in the second half. If you're on the offensive side, don't look for the quick score. Just look to pick up positive yards and hope it leads you to a score later. Let's see what they do on first down following that huge play. And he takes off. Got a big lane and gains maybe four. That leads us to second down. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Pryor's got it in the gun. Eric Decker hauls in that bullet pass. Here they are inside the 20, and they keep their hopes alive as they move down the field. Yeah, they've done that. Now they got to do the hard part when you get to this this part of the field in the red zone we know the defense is not worried about deep throws down the field you got to hit those seams we'll see if they can get it done second and goal from the four good for only a yard here we are late in the game they're getting blown out and they got a chance to score before it's all over yeah you, you always hear get a little confidence score a touchdown here he have something to build on for next week that's the only way you can look at it uh, in a game like this on the offensive side Quarterback coming to the line. Hopefully to avoid being sacked. And he's in for the touchdown. 
Got to be able to take advantage of the quarterback sneak. If the defense doesn't line up properly, find the weak spot and go there to score. Here's the hit. So put down a touchdown and a two-point conversion on that occasion. Yeah, good job by the offense. They executed the play perfectly, and they got it in the end zone, like you said, and got that two points. This kick will stay on the ground, avoiding a big return. Davis is in on the tackle. The Steelers come to the line, starting the drive at the 37. This will be the final snap. Takes the knee. How much sweeter is practice going to be this week after the win on that sideline. Once you win, practice is easier because your confidence is high. You feel good about what you've done from the previous week because you won. So I think it always gives you a better chance of winning the following week because you feel so good when you're out there in that practice field. What a memorable game this truly was. For Phil Simms, Danielle Bellini, and Larry Ridley, Jim Nance saying so long for now, and we leave you with the GMC Never Say Never moment of the game.